Hi, it's Rick here. A few users have been emailing me and asking about folder management inside of Panther and uh, if there are any options for that. And I just wanted to give you a quick overview of a solution. So if you come to the top of the little uh, cog or settings menu here in the top right hand corner and click there, if you scroll down you'll see there's a section called library. So just select that and that will open up in the default uh, folder location and this libraries folder is just like you would see in your file manager in Windows so you can go up in folders or down in folders you know simply clicking uh, to go into various sections now I've got a folder here called drawing CAD and it's numbered in my case but you might use customer names or job numbers or something like that and I can open up any of the files in these folders so if I just simply double click I'll go into that folder and see the jobs or the drawings that I've done and saved in that folder. Now you can simply right click and choose view and view these as large or extra large icons if you like. I'll just change that back to view large and the great thing about using this is you can drag and drop any of these 3DM files into your scene or drawing to open it up. So if I select something and drag it across you'll see that I have the options to either open the file, insert the file, import the file or attach the file. Now the two I normally use are open file or import file. Open file will open obviously th that drawing and um, close the previous drawing that you've got open so it will open up that uh, saved drawing import file will import let's say a component or another file into the existing open file that you've got okay so I'll show you quickly both of those so I'll just hit cancel here and I'll just go back up in my folders here and I'm going to go to this folder and again if the view is too small those icons are too small you can simply right click and say view and view them as large and I'm going to drag and drop this into my drawing here. I'm going to say open file and click OK. It'll prompt me to say do I want to save any changes to the existing drawing which is open. I'm going to say no there. And that opens up that particular drawing. Now in the case where you've got components and certain components that you might want to use that you've you've saved maybe there the settings for maybe a three stone ring or something like that and you want to drop that into a different shank or a different sized ring shank and adjust it you can do that so I'll just select this head setting here and drag and drop it again I'll get the message here when I drag and drop it to either open it which is not what I want to do here I want to import this file so I just simply click on import and click OK and that's imported that whole entire file into my scene so you'll see I can then you know select that and drag it up here and then make adjustments you know as I need so if I click on this and click my middle mouse wheel I can come in and edit this so I adjust the open distance here make it a bit smaller So that's basically it. I just wanted to give you a quick overview of that, of the libraries functions, and uh, just show how that works. So it's a quick handy way of managing your files and folders. Obviously you need to create some drawing structure in here, but if I was to create a new drawing, you know, I've got 0220, I would just right click here and say new, new folder, and the new folder, uh, sorry, the new folder, if I click on that, I can call it 0221, for instance, the next consecutive number, job number for me, and that's blank. So I could go and save this into that folder if I wanted to. Okay, that's it. I hope it helps. See you later. Bye for now.